So I want you to be able to finish. Back in seven George, uh, we're going to have you back up, try to support your whistleblowing, hopefully have you back up in the next few weeks so we can just take calls and talk about going after Maury Strong, the Climate Gate people, Ben Santer, uh, all of them, Phil Jones. We need to have these people exposed and indicted. A lot of them already are in the process or have been indicted. Uh, but let's go to Bob in Ohio. You're on the air in a final quick segment with George Hunt. Amazing interview. We appreciate George's courage. Bob, you're on the air. Go ahead. Hey, how you doing? Good. Uh, I've been meaning to call for a long time, and it's uh, crazy how apropos this call will be today. But I moved into the sticks uh, early 90s, about the same t time period, and uh, I became associated with someone who claimed to be in league or knew of the elites and was close personal friends with them. He tapped me as a guy who was intelligent and for some reason wanted me to know some facts. And uh, he asked me if I ever knew about the New World Order and the Trilateral Commission and those things. And I told him I knew some things. And so he, I, he invited me to ask him some questions. I said, how will we know when the New World Order is going to be installed? Or first, first, I said, how... Will, how will they go about installing it? He said they'll get us in so many conflicts around the globe that we won't be able to defend ourselves. And a seemingly foreign power would step in and take us over. I said, how will we know when it's about to happen? And he said, if they ever hit the Pentagon, look out. And it was whenever 9-11 happened to me. And, of course, that was years before that. And this it guy just, said that he was a, a member of the elite. He was affiliated with them. He was a very yeah, they intelligent love, man. Uh, they love to brag. Uh, George Hunt, comments on what Bob just said. Oh, they love to brag. And I wish that you had a uh, recorder with you when you're talking to that person. They were one of the ones that were in the know. And they like to, people to know that they're in the know. But if anyone finds out that they've told their secrets, they get killed. Bob, call us back late. again. Call us back again sometime because I want to hear more of your story. Thank you. Finishing up, George, go ahead. Well, I don't know how to finish this except that uh, we are uh, confronted with a new world order that will take away the freedom of every citizen in the world. And if we don't, if we don't, if we don't call them out now, we never will. This is our well, last chance. You said, I agree with you, you said it earlier, though. This is the moment of truth. They're coming in like a flood, but the Spirit of the Lord is lifting up a standard against them. And all of us, myself, you, millions of others, we are that standard against the enemy. That's right. And, 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 and when we do fight, we beat them. And so people need to see themselves as leaders, wake up their friends, their families, their neighbors, educate them. Films are a great way. Uh, to do it. Radio shows are a great way to do it. Read books, get educated yourself, educate your city council. When these environmentalists come around, they want to steal your property, brainwash your kids on record. They've got to be stopped. And uh, George, I'm glad you're doing an investigation on Maury Strong and others. And you're talking about filing suit on them uh, through the uh, whistleblower uh, international groups. And uh, when can we hear more about that coming up? Um, I'll be filing suit within two weeks. And um, after I find a uh, a lawyer that that is up to the fight, and um, then after they're sued, they'll probably pay, pay some heavy fines, and I'll get thirty percent of their heavy fines because I'm an official whistle blower. So there's something in it for people that blow whistles. And you can use that to fight them more. You've certainly spent a lot of time the last twenty two years fighting uh, these people, and we're just glad that you. Uh almost bumbled into all of this and that you were an uh, upstanding person who would have the courage to fight them and expose them. The website is thebigbadbank.com. Got books and videos there available. And again, endgame at infowars.com, the preeminent film to expose this entire agenda. George, let me say bye to you during the break. And we're going to be talking to you again and uh, Jan and other great folks in your office uh, about having you back on and phase two of our operation against the New World Order.